you need to find the greatest common factor for 21 and 27, here's how you do it. So the greatest common factor, sometimes that's called the greatest common divisor or the highest common factor. I like greatest common factor. So we're going to make a list of all the factors of 21 and 17. Then we'll compare the list, find the factor that's the greatest, the one that's common between these two, but it's the greatest. So for 21, 1 times 21, that equals 21, and 3 times 7, I think that's it. 27, 1 times 27, that equals 27, and then 3 times 9. And I think those are the factors for 27. So let's find the factors that are in common and then choose the greatest. 1, they both have 1, so that's in common, and then looks like 3, that's it. So 3 is the greatest factor that goes into both 21 and 27 evenly. So in answer to our question, the greatest common factor for 21 and 27, that's 3. You could do this through other methods such as prime factorization, but for numbers that are smaller like this, it's a good way to do it. It's Dr. B. Thanks for watching.